It's so like, even if it's really slow, you can just time it right and just go. So, obviously by the title of the video, I'm going to show you how to, in my opinion, that at least how to effectively use Lupus. Um, like, at least all of his abilities, like, how to properly really use them, in, in my opinion. And for me, it works out pretty well. Like, I try to maximize like this character as best as I can and do everything I can to like juke people out or you know obviously win the game but yeah since I got him level 100 I'll show you everything like how obviously how to use the abilities the correct way and how to kind of cheese people Unless they're really good, then it, it'll be kind of difficult. But overall, this is how it'll be. So obviously, I'll show you. I'll start off with the extendo arm, which works really well for you're in a face off. Doesn't really work so much if you're not in a 1v1 face off, you know, with one guy. But I mean, you obviously get gems for hurting people. So it. I mean, at least if you can somehow hurt someone and just go like that. I mean, sometimes it works, but not not all the time. No way, bro. Oh my gosh, whatever. Well, this is like my first game on. I'm a bit rusty right now. I'm not I'm not like the best at this game. I'm really not. I, but yeah, I, I mean, I'm I'm average, I guess you could say. But anyways, you know, you can like, I can try to go like that, and oh, like right there. See that that kind of worked out. But it doesn't work all the time, you know. Like someone, I mean, sometimes, but I don't really do it so much when it's not in a face-off because it's like almost useless in a sense. Just for like, I don't know. I mean, not completely useless, I guess, but I wouldn't. I don't know. I mean, I, I guess you can. If you really obviously want to get gems, which obviously you do. Then I mean, you can try to keep doing it mid game. Just keep doing that. You kind of have to time it right. Like it's like right next to someone, you know, then just kind of do it. Versus just randomly doing it. I don't know but hopefully I'll get to face off and I'll show you how to like you have to really time that ability right when they're about to hit the ball and it depends how fast it's going too so you got to time it really well so you're gonna face off and you hit the ball and it gets pretty close to them like close enough where you can like use the extendo arm ability before they hit it because then by the time your ability the extendo arm hits the ball they they will just hit it and then it'll bounce back right away like instantly when they hit it so then they won't have time to react fast enough to you know like double hit the ball i'll try right here i'll try to hurt someone i should say with this endo arm kind of hard to do it when it's not face off but now you know, I, I, it'll go like this. Like that. It'll go like this. Like that. See, as soon as it turned red, you had to time it just right. That's how it would work, and he wouldn't have time to react and hit it again. And then he would for sure take that one damage. Oh, I see that wall worked out pretty well right there. Oh, I did that one too late. Oh, it is face off. All right, cool. So like, even if it's really slow, you can just time it right and just go. 
the van. Alright, just go. And that person had one HP, so that was automatically gonna be a win right there, but that's how you would properly use the extendo arm. Gumball Balloon, the second ability right here, is pretty uh pretty pointless in my opinion. I mean it it's it's like a it's like in a sense to me, it's like a scaredy cat move to use, you know, like you wanna get away from someone, you can just fly up really high just to get away from the battle like if you really, really want to last to 1v1 just use the gumball and just keep flying all the time so the ball rarely comes to you when the first when the game first starts all right so we use the ability and then press jump and it gives you a little boost to fly up two times higher but it's kind of weird because i noticed like if you kind of like jump too late or something i don't know like it, you don't fly up i don't know unless it was just me i, I feel like some like i don't know maybe it's just me like if i jump really late now oh it still works okay i don't know i swear there was one day i was like i felt like i had a time to jump with that ability so i could go higher but maybe not this guy wants to 1v1 so bad give me the ball give me the ball Anyways, all right, let's just go to the glass wall since that one is actually useful. The gumball one is, I don't know, it, it's okay. I mean, I guess if someone's, if you're lucky and someone's not using ball cam, which I'm sure most people don't and most people do at the same time, so I don't know. But if you use the gumball and then go really high and then hit the ball, if it does come to you, then I mean, Then I mean, it could work. I'm like focused right now. I'm locked in. <laughs> I'm locked in right now. This dude is, this dude is trying so hard to 1v1 anyone. Okay, well, I killed him. Okay. So the ball's going to him. Just time it right and go like this. Takes one shot automatically. Get really close to someone. They don't expect to use the wall. Oh, you lucky butthole. Oh, I still got him with the wall. <laughs> So the wall is useful in the sense of if you know the boss like okay like it you can like you can like intercept people and then when the ball is going to someone else just get right in front of them put up the wall and then nine out of ten the ball will come to you since you're the closest person right there and then since obviously the wall is right there they have to hit the ball really fast like instantly no way but yeah so like watch see the ball is going to someone over here like this okay well if this guy wasn't trying so hard either then okay where's the other guy i want to want to go after him really come here <laughs> oh my gosh He's not even paying attention. All right, so it goes to him, go like this, bam, bam. Doesn't work all the time, but if someone's really good at the game and you know it's hard to use the wall on someone, then you just kind of have to keep trying and hopefully it'll work. Eventually you'll get it, you know, you'll, you'll eventually like because, dude, when you put the wall in front of someone, when the ball's going towards them, it's... Okay. It's hard to, like... Dude! <laughs> I put the glass wall! We play that. Anyways, yeah, so the glass wall, if you get in someone's face or it's really good for interfering so if you're in the start of the match and there's two people like actually going at it like pretty close and the ball's freaking out just go up to them use the glass wall and break up the fight i guess <laughs> like literally 
and then that way the ball will like bounce off your wall and kind of juke the other person and go around them and they won't expect it sometimes it, it really all depends you might hurt someone with the wall by doing that i always try to do that because there's a chance that you could hurt someone and get gems from it if you hit someone um but it, it just all depends how good the people are or how lucky they are if they even hit the ball but i don't know ball cam's pretty clutch but sometimes it's not like if you really want to kill someone okay i thought the ball come to me right there but because they wouldn't expect it to hit so fast you know they're like oh the ball bounced back that fast but it won't work on it won't work that well in a more experienced player but it could it still could as a chance depending how fast they click it how lucky they are whatever even if the ball is not coming towards you you can obviously hit the ball with the wall like i just did earlier so that way you can you know if if the ball is not coming towards you and it goes to someone else you can still use the wall and block them from hitting it then like then that way they might accidentally misclick you know i did not mean to use that ability <laughs> the time hacky hockey how do you pronounce it like right here i'm gonna interfere never mind okay never mind oh he's doing it too oh my dude i can't believe he got me with that one Dang. so that's kind of the best way to explain using the wall gotta like block people i mean you can interfere with people when they're mid battle obviously and you can break up a fight try to go up to go right up to people and then use the wall oh you lucky bro you lucky I thought I I thought I timed that more than better than I thought, but you got it. But anyways, the fourth ability, the time one. Really useful. You gotta time it right. Just like all the other abilities really. Every character in this game, you just gotta be really good at timing stuff. That's really it. That's literally it. So the time one. Time one works really well, like when the ball is going really fast you know and then bam right when it gets right up to them like not super close where they can hit it but like almost you gotta use the time ability see like right there would have been perfect if i was more of a newbie i guess <laughs> i'd have like oh my gosh and then i would have for sure maybe took me damage oh wow no way i really thought i clicked that all right whatever um but yeah it, the time one is pretty clutch i try to time it right i try to also like when the ball is in between two people you can still use a time ability and the ball will go slow between those two people and someone might take damage but i don't know i try to i try to like let other people kill each other by using the time ability when they're like doing a 1v1 and there's like 10 of us alive still and i'm like all right, they're going at it. I'm going to use it and see if one of them messes up. That way, everyone else can try to take damage. But, yeah, I mean, it works sometimes. Sometimes it doesn't because usually two sweats going at it. But, yeah, like, time ability, that's really, that's really it, dude. You, I mean, in a 1v1 face-off, it, it can kind of work. Like, at least I always try to do it when the ball is right by them, but not too close, you know, because if you use the ability right after you hit the ball, then then it wouldn't make sense because then they still have more of a reaction time. Like there's still a gap between the ball and that person so they can still react in time to hit it. So if you use the ability when it's pretty close to them, but not close enough where they're like, we'll hit it. Cause you can you can still hit the ball when it's in slow motion, so 
so it's like so it's like you know it's just it's all depending if the person even wants to hit it or if they're too scared to hit it or if they try to full send it but sometimes it's scared to full send it because it's like oh my god the ability gonna end and then when it does the ball is gonna mock speed in your face but yeah i mean that, that's the best way to use the time one like right here i'll try to never mind <laughs> I mean, it even works when the ball's going slow. It doesn't have to go fast. I think it works better when it's going fast. Because it also goes mock speed after slow motion. But, like, right here, I'll try to see if I can cheese it. Oh, I didn't cheese that one. I mean, it works sometimes. It, it's the, oh, well, that wasn't me, though. That was someone else. That was kind of good timing. Oh, that was good timing. <laughs> Whoever had that one, whoever did that, that was pretty good time usability right there. Take someone out almost. See if I interfere and use a glass wall I'll go like this. Wink. Wink. Oh! Oh, it almost worked, dude. He misclicked too. It almost worked. Oh wow, I was so ready for that. <laughs> dude's trying to kill everyone. Not today, boy. Not today. I'm sorry, dude. <laughs> you look you don't look like you're played the game that long. I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. Had to be done. Like right there was pretty good. Doesn't always work in everyone, but you know it's worth a shot. It's worth a shot because it, it can work, you know. Now, uh, all right. Oh gosh, hold on, I misclicked. Oh, <laughs> oh my! Someone needs to. Oh my gosh, bro, time that one actually pretty good. I'm not even gonna lie. Okay. I can just go like pink. Oh, dude, I timed it too slow. That was too late. Or I mean too early. My bad. Too early. <laughs> the ball hit my wall twice and it faked them out right there. So that was that was pretty good right there. That was pretty good. Pretty good play. But yeah, that, that's that's the best way, in my opinion, to use all your abilities like to its potential. You know, like especially if you're playing pros. I mean, you can use extend arm and like when the game starts and try to at least hurt someone so you can get gems from it. But it's all fifty fifty. If well, it's not even fifty fifty, I mean, pros is hard because people are pretty good. So it's like. It's hard to like damage people, but it works sometimes. I've done it a few times where I've hurt people using an extended arm. I try to use it right before they hit it. Sometimes it kind of works, but. Or when they're doing a 1v1 face off right here and you just use extended arm so the ball flies out. So they don't, ex they don't expect it to happen like that. That works well sometimes too, so. Uh, yeah, I'll just do a little gameplay now of me using the ability so you can you guys can hope to understand it a little easier At least how I do it. I mean unless there is a better effective way of using this character I wouldn't know. I mean, I've been using him for a while. I've been trying to Oh I'm Trying to figure out how the best way to use this ability. I timed that time one wrong. I meant to do it before it hits him. Oh, do it. Do it. Oh. Uh, oh, I timed the one wrong, too. Oh, I so No, I misclicked once. Dude. Oh, because of that misclick. Oh, I said I'll stop talking, but that was god awful. I'm going to die this game. I'm annoyed now. <laughs> I'm so annoyed. Oh, my gosh. I'm funny. I hate when you misclick once.
up close like that. Bam! Oh, dude, I gotta get bro this. This is oh, that was perfectly timed. It he almost hit it too. I could tell that was actually kind of close. Oh, I just turned on ball cam. I knew the ball was gonna be all weird. <laughs> Ball's gonna juke someone. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Oh, <laughs> oh I'm so dead though. I'm so dead. I gotta shut up. I said I'll be quiet. I keep talking. So I'm not used to just not talking. I'm gonna mess someone up here. Oh, mess me up. All right. <laughs> I messed myself up. That was perfect time to use extend the arm or in slow motion and juke them and he misclicked and the ability turned off right there that was really good that was like a the best <laughs> that was the best time thing i've ever done in my life that was great That was juked, bro. My wall faked him out. He he definitely wasn't ready for that one. Oh my gosh. I feel like it's straight luck when you do face off like that between you and one person. Oh, I killed him. Wait. Are you even playing? Why did you use the ability, man? I was trying to fake that person out, but oh, she is. Sorry, dude. I'm so sorry. Oh, you must click that one. Every time I use the ability, someone else always uses it too, and it's like right after me too. I'm coming for you, my guy. Oh, dude, if it would have came after me, he would have so not been ready for that one. Yeah, as soon as you must click once, buddy. I'm sorry. Nope. Oh, that would have faked him out too. You think you can hide from me, bro? You really think you can hide from me? Never mind. <laughs> oh. Oh, I misclicked. Oh my gosh. Oh gosh, I almost lost. Wow. So I had to use like sender arm right there for sure. I timed that perfectly. Right before he hit it, I used ability. And then he hit it and then bounced back right away and he didn't expect to come right back to him. There's times where you can do that ability like so perfectly where like when the person hits the ball, it's like I hit him again like instantly. I've had people do it to me like so fast like I mean I've tried when I know people have left this I try to double click sometimes because I'm like I don't know if they're gonna do it that's like the one scary thing about going against someone who has left this it's like dude I don't know when they're gonna do the extended arm to time it right and if they're really good at timing it's scary it's really scary but depending what character you have if you don't have left this just try to I don't know That guy's not even playing. That guy's not playing either. Oh, now he is? Okay. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. You must click twice. Oh, he got it. I should have went closer to him. Woohoo. 
fake you out. Gonna fake you out. Oh, oh, oh. He's gonna hit it though. Oh, I got him. Dude, the ball's going too slow. There's no way. Oh, I'm sorry, my guy. Had to happen to someone. Oh, oh that's karma for me. Sorry, bro. I just had to come for you. <laughs> I'm so sorry. And one thing I like about not having ball cam on is you can hit the ball and point it to someone. Because then, like, sometimes people won't expect it. Sometimes. Sometimes. Oh! I was say, why did my ability work? Oh, fake him all twice? Oh. Oh. That ball was juking him, too. Oh, he still hit it. Okay. Oh, wow. Someone didn't expect the ball to come to them. Oh, my ability hasn't loaded yet. YOLO. YOLO. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> like right there it works great. When you time your user time. And then like right when you hit it and it goes decently fast where like they may or may not have reaction time to hit it. Oh he hit it. You want a 1v1 so bad. <laughs> Freaking butt. I feel bad for this guy because I can just go like this. Oh, move, bro. Freaking dodge it, bro. You just had to dodge it. That's all you had to do. Like, ow, what the, what the, dang, she's good, holy cows, I don't know how she hit that, that almost killed me. Why is this Apocalypse Bat legendary? This thing is stupid. That juke was insane. I dashed and I hit the ball away from that chick. It came right back to her like that. That was clutch. I lost the ball. I should have clicked R so I can quickly ball cam it. I know where it is. Gosh. I'm 
I'm sorry, guy. <laughs> Didn't move all game yesterday. Or yesterday. Last game. Made me very angry. Oh gosh, I misclicked. Oh, I didn't even aim it at you. What? What? Okay, the ball juked me. I'm I'm done. I'm ending the video. I'm done. <laughs> I'm so done.